Here is a small community that makes a living from fish trading. The Kado district is part of the Abuja Municipal Area Council in the Federal Capital Territory and about 15 minutes drive from the city center. The main occupation of the residents in the area is petty trading, but the center of attraction in Kado is the popular fish market. Kado Fish Market is popularly known for its cheap wholesale distribution with many different sections for various species of fish, ranging from ice fish to dry fish and live fish also known as point and kill. Here are some fish dealers arriving the market from Ibadan at a car park just opposite the market. It is from this point that traders take the fish into the markets to sell on retail or wholesale quantity. The Kado Fish Market sees traders and customers from far and near. This keeps the community going and provides economic opportunities. A resident, Ramatsu Abubakar, says that the fish market has given many residents job opportunities. As me, I want to start my own business. I come buy one, they leave one for me. As they mark, will buy for my hand, they leave one for me, 700. So the place where they cut them for me, they cut them to 200. My own game, like 300 or 400. That one better pass the one way you go sit down for house, so they don't know anything to do. According to dealers, the fish are gotten mainly from Lagos and Port Harcourt. Some are imported while others are from local fishermen. Many lament the major challenge of epileptic power supply and bad roads for transportation. As far as this business is concerned, you cannot do the business without electricity. You understand. And once there's no light, in fact, there's very many of us has gone out of the business because of the power supply. Our challenge is, is uh, it's, to bring it here is a long journey. And uh, before we are used to travel at night, but now you know, it's not the same thing again because of uh, thief and other things at night. Okay. So, where have you come from to buy this fish? From Kubo. Okay, why all the way from Kubo? Fish is cheaper and better here. More dealers share their ordeal in transporting the fish from various parts of the country to this point. We pass a lot of risk to bring the fish here. Especially as we broke uh, this road, uh, Okene Road. So it's difficult for us to bring the fish here. Yeah, I'm going to just now by the grace of God. Uh, why do you come all the way from um, just like that? Uh, because we always gain profit when we come to buy from Abuja. This is the only wholesale market that we can get it cheaper. A total of 50 baths containing 1,200 kilograms of catfish is what a bus brings into town for sale weekly. One bus, they carry 50 baths. So that 50 bath will contain that 1,250 kg. They carry and come to Abuja here. So if they come, sometimes this, this, sometimes they die. Sometimes you know they die about the fish. This business, they, the, the business of the fish, you know, they easy to do. Behind the market and towards the exit gate is the catfish section. The traders are regulated by a team of executives. The financial secretary, Muritala Ademu, has spent eight years in the trade. He explains that an average of 15,000 naira is made on each trip, and three of such trips can be made in a week. According to how the market is moving, we bring like two times or three times a week. Here you hear And like that one ton, if they bring it from there to here, just at least you know how the business is now, it's lucky. Maybe you figure like uh, 15,000, 20,000 in one ton from there to here. And we used to get it at least like two times a week or if market move three times a week. Or sometimes if, if the market is very low, it's only one time a week. The rise in consumption of fish in Nigeria continues to increase the annual demand. Meanwhile, only about 40% of fish consumed in the country is produced locally. There are many more fish markets and individual fish farms in Abuja and other parts of the country. Analysts advocate that attention should be given to this trade to empower both young and old in creating jobs for the unemployed.